Hello, Lauren. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Doing well. Well, are you ready for your 73 questions? Let's, Let's do it. So, who who are you? So, my name's Lauren. Um, I'm a sophomore at Columbia. Okay. What's your major? I'm studying sustainable development with a concentration in environmental science. Cool. Where are you from? I'm from the Bahamas, Freeport, Grand Bahama. Ah, Lauren, how do you like Columbia? I love it. I definitely do. Why do you choose it? I wanted to be in the city. Oh, one to ten, how similar is Columbia to the movies? One, nothing like it, or ten, it's identical. I'd say it's seven. Seven. If you had to choose a song to describe your college experience, what would you choose? I feel like Survivor by Destiny's Child. <laughs> Love it. What's your favorite thing about Columbia? Um, I really like just being outside. I think it's a beautiful campus, definitely. Okay. What Columbia stereotype holds true? Um, we're definitely workaholics. For sure. Rate your dining hall experience, one to ten. Eight. Eight. What's the best dining hall on campus? I think Hewitt at Barnard's really good and Ferris. Okay. What's the worst thing you've ever ate at the dining hall? I had some really disgusting egg rolls. Egg rolls. Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> What's the go-to place for late night snacks? JJ's. 100%. JJ's. Where are we right now? So right now we're at one of my favorite libraries, which is the engineering library. And this is Pupin with 11 classes, um, Shapiro, and a bunch of other classes. Is this your favorite place on campus? Um, one of them, but I can take you to my favorite Ooh, place Ooh, let's campus. go! What clubs are you involved in on campus? Um, so I'm in Columbia Eco Reps, um, Columbia Black Professional Society, and um, the Caribbean Student Association. <laughs> Which one's your favorite? Um, just one. I just like one? Just one again. Who's your ride or die on campus? Oh, I have to say, my best friend Susie. Susie. We've, we've been together through some things. <laughs> is there Greek life on campus? There is. Are you in a sorority? I am not. For not being one, do you experience FOMO? Um, I don't think so, because I can still go to the parties. So I'm fine. Which house throws the best parties on campus? Definitely feel like it'd be one of the athlete frats. So like either Sikai or. Okay. How often do people go to parties at Columbia? I would say like three times. Okay. What is a typical Columbia party outfit? I'd say like maybe up top and shorts. Okay. You have to wear sneakers. How late do your parties run until? Uh, if your school was an alcohol, would it be a fine wine, a scotch, beer, or tequila? Um, I'm gonna go with vodka. Actually. Vodka. Okay. Why? How late do your library stay open? Um, pretty late. I'd say like midnight, but something that's like 24 hours to study room. Okay. How many libraries are on campus? A lot. <laughs> I'd say maybe like 8 to 10 on the media yeah. campus. Okay. Are they social or silent? Um, it depends. Honestly, you can get a little bit of both. Okay. Where's your favorite place to study on campus? Uh, probably my room. Your room? Okay. Are you sleep deprived? No. Thank goodness. <laughs> Thank God. How many hours of sleep do you get a day? How often do you do homework day? Um, two. What's your best tip for juggling social life and academics? Don't forget. Good time management. Time management. One to ten, how attractive is your campus? Ooh, for this question, we're going to have to sit down. Oh, okay. Yes. Um, but I'm going to have to split it up for girls and guys. Mm -hmm. Um, I'd say for girls, definitely like eight and a half, nine, because I think we're pretty hot. <laughs> um, but for guys, maybe a seven or a good day. Okay. Hookups or ships? What's the dating culture like? Hookups. I don't know many relationships. Here. Wow. Which athletic team has the most clout? We are a basketball team, I think. Okay. One to ten, how would you rank your school spirit? Um, I think personally mine is like a nine and a half, ten, but... Columbia's like a three. So. <laughs> I was so tired from all that walking. How much do you guys walk a day? Um, pretty often. It depends where your classes are, but you have to walk to get places. Fair enough. Do people use bikes or skateboards or scooters? Um, not very often, I don't think. No. Okay. How athletic would you rank your school from Olympian to part time couch potato? I feel like most of our teams are like not bad, but like average ish, but we have the best fencing team. Oh, did not know that. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like you have to wear makeup to class or is athlete chic always allowed? Uh, definitely athlete chic. I don't wear makeup to class. <laughs> Fair enough. What's the typical temperature during the winter? Cold. Cold. <laughs> I'd say maybe like 15, 20 
90 degrees probably. Okay. What's an essential item to bring to campus when you move in? Warm clothes. Okay. Is there an article of clothing that you see everyone wear on campus? Canada Goose jackets are pretty popular in the winter. Okay. How often do you leave campus? I think like once a week. Okay. What year are people allowed to move off campus? Um, I think after freshman year. Okay. Fill in the blank. If you had known blank about Columbia, I would have never chosen it. Probably how little free time I was going to have. Fair enough. Let's continue with the tour. Yes. Let's keep going. What's the most embarrassing thing you've seen anybody do on campus? Once in one of my like 840 lectures, um, this kid fell asleep and he was snoring. And this kid oh no! Up. So that was pretty dramatic. Have you ever seen a uh, celebrity on campus? Um, I saw Sadie Sink. Oh! Who's your favorite alumni? Um, Obama. It has to be. Has definitely. to be. How often do you see Columbia's president? Like maybe twice a year. Okay. Do you think you've met a future millionaire? Oh, 100%. Yeah. Is your school academically competitive, or do you guys help each other out? Uh, I think it depends on your friend group, honestly, but I know people help each other out. Okay, that's good. Do the majority of kids on campus want to change the world or want to be rich? It's a big mix, honestly. There's lots of econ majors, so everyone's trying to secure the bag. <laughs> um, but definitely there are some like, future change makers here. Okay. Do most graduates you know have jobs? Yeah. Okay, good. If you could change one thing about your school, what would it be? Um, the lack of school spirit. Lack of school spirit. Number one tip for success at Columbia? Uh, I would say good time management. Good time management. How close is Columbia to Times Square? Uh, about 20 minutes on the subway. Okay. Columbia is in the city. How, does, how do you like the area? Um, I love the area. The Morningside area is like really quiet and really mm. nice, but like the city is very close. So. Gotcha. Where are we right now? So right now we are on low step. Um, low Beach, as we love to call it, and it's like one of the best places when the sun is shining, everyone comes up here. Alma, our statue is right there, so we love to see it. Yes. What is your favorite thing to do off campus? Um, good food, great restaurants, definitely. How fashionable is your campus? Um, I'd say we're pretty, pretty chic. All right, give it to us. <laughs> is Columbia diverse? Uh, yeah. Do you think there needs to be more diversity? There's always room for more diversity. How clean are the dorms when you move in freshman year? Okay. If you could replace your mascot with any animal that represents your school, what would you choose? I feel like the lion's pretty fitting, but that might just be because I don't want to get rid of our fight song. Fair enough. Like <laughs> Describe the best party you've been to. Uh, it was probably one of our like parties in East Campus, which is like a senior dorm. But like the party itself probably wasn't fun, but my friends and I turned it into a good time. <laughs> Should everyone watching apply to Columbia? Yes. Why? I think it's a great place to be, honestly. The people here are nice. The campus is beautiful, as you can all see. And it's great. Awesome, that's it. Thanks, Lauren. Have a good one.